Welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube history. This is Sean's View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe with an explosive update as it concerns Randy Orton, Money in the Bank, and that involvement as it concerns this year's SummerSlam pay-per-view. A lot of news, a lot of rumors, a lot of speculation coming around about SummerSlam uh, today, and I'll tell you what, I'm here to give my view on everything. I'm here to give my take on it. It is being uh, reported by the Wrestling Observer Newsletter that there is word, there is some talk, some rumblings uh, going around backstage. And like I said, the link to proof the source is in the description of this video from the Wrestling Observer Newsletter. That Daniel Bryan versus John Cena at SummerSlam for the WWE title has been confirmed and will happen. They have it that Daniel Bryan wins this match. And we all know how Daniel Bryan is over. We all know how everyone wants to see him the WWE Champion. But we also know how everyone's been wanting Randy Orton to turn heel. Well, Daniel Bryan would win the WWE title. Have one hell of a successful win. Be over. The fans going nuts, going crazy. And then all of a sudden, Randy Orton comes out. He cashes in the money in the bank briefcase on Daniel Bryan. And thus, not only does Randy Orton defeat Daniel Bryan... After Daniel Bryan defeats John Cena for the WWE title, but Randy Orton would then successfully have turned heel. Can you imagine the kind of reaction? Can you imagine the backlash if this occurs? Now, this isn't set in stone, but this is the projected plan as said by the Wrestling Observer Newsletter. And you know what? That would be the perfect scenario because you want to talk about turning heel. You want to talk about a revolution. You want to talk about a revolt. You want to talk about instant heat. Randy Orton probably would have succeeded in one of the greatest heel turns in WWE history if this plan comes to fruition. Your comments and your opinions, and when you think about it, that's going to make a lot of people upset. That's going to make a lot of people angry. Daniel Bryan becomes the WWE Champion finally after all his hard work, after all the determination, after his will, after all the people that wanted to see this manifest itself only for Daniel Bryan. And, well, you know what? This has happened to uh, the, the big show and Mark Henry. Remember when Daniel Bryan cashed in on them one time and they didn't really get their time to shine, so to speak. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be something else. I'll tell you, SummerSlam just sounds like it's going to get better and better. And I I'm lost for words. I mean, if this happens, can you imagine what those fans... I mean, I can only imagine the feeling in the arena that night if, if that happens. Daniel Bryan works his ass off, defeats John Cena as if that wasn't already a mountain of a climb, and then to try to overcome Randy Orton from cashing in his money bank. So they're, they're, they're killing like two birds with one stone. Daniel Bryan defeats John Cena, and then Randy Orton turned, well, actually three birds. They're, kill, they're killing one bird with three stones. They're, 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 they're going to successfully have Daniel Bryan defeat John Cena. They're going to have Randy Orton cash in, and then Randy Orton turn heel. All those things happening in one night. Like I said, this is going to be a mega event at SummerSlam of epic proportions. And I know people are going to be saying, what a miscarriage of justice. But it will be justice for all the right reasons. For the Apex Predator, the age of Orton, Randy Orton. Subscribe.